Hey everyone, what's up? I'm Wiggling Wolf. Hope y'all are having a good day. Blade Dancers are back. It's official. I've been playing with them kind of off off YouTube and off stream for a while. Uh, just test them out, see if they're up to par. And they are. They're good. They're good again. They're not year one good. Uh, if you guys remember then, they were pretty dominant in the Crucible. They're not that good still. But their hit registration is basically fixed. Um, I only ran into maybe one or two insta instances where it wasn't really working and those were basically when I was going straight at someone. I wasn't coming down on them from above or just or moving at them from the sides. Um, that's really how you want to play with the Blade Dancer anyways. You never really want to go straight at somebody otherwise you have a higher chance of losing that battle just because of the way Blade Dancer swipes are timed. So. Um, just watch out for that if you go and try and play it after this video. Other than that stuff, it's fixed. It feels balanced. It doesn't feel like overpowered. It honestly feels about as good as a storm caller if you can use it correctly. Um, so, you, you know, like or the hunter equivalent of the storm caller if you can use it correctly. Um, the blade answer hunter's neutral game though is better than the storm callers in my personal opinion, just because of the uh, amount of speed that it has. Um, I think that outweighs the warlock's melee range. In my personal opinion, um, that's obviously up for you guys to, to decide, though. Um, but I have a dilemma. I have a huge dilemma. What subclass should I play? Um, basically, the second half of year one, right at the start of House of Wolves, I played a Blade Dancer Hunter. I was a, I was a Thorn Shotgunner, as I said in one of my previous videos. I was an ultimate asshole <laughs> Destiny player. Uh, it was obviously all before I started YouTube stuff, um, but I was a Blade Dancer, I fell in love with the, man, the amount of speed that it had. Yeah, I'm very used to that class, I know how that class works, um, I've pseudo-mastered it, uh, maybe there's a couple things I could perfect with it, but I've basically mastered the Blade Dancer because I played it so much after House of Wolves. That being said, before House of Wolves, from vanilla all the way to Dark Below, um, to, you know, right before House of Wolves, as I said like five times, I played a Striker Titan. Um, I was a Striker Titan. I was pretty good at it, too. Um, I know how to Titan skate. Um, I know that play style very well also. Um, arguably, I've played Striker Titan longer than I've played Blade Dancer. So I'm good with Titans, too. My, the first character I created was a Warlock, and I just never played it. So. I have a dilemma. What class do you guys want to see me play? So the classes I would like you guys to pick from are the Blade Dancer Hunter, um, maybe Gunslinger, but we'll stick with Blade Dancer. So Blade Dancer Hunter, the Stormcaller, which I've been playing a lot recently, having a lot of success with, or the Sunbreaker, which I'm pretty good at using now also, because the hammers, for whatever reason, after the April update, feel like they're actually hitting, as opposed to just like totally whipping. So. Your choices are Blade Dancer, Stormcaller, or Sunbreaker. You guys let me know in the comments what you want to watch, um, because I'm pretty equally good with all of them. Um, so, And I will play that class, I will main it, or I will take it into consideration as what my main will be. I like to have a main, A lot. some people don't really have a main, but I like to have one. But yeah, let me know in the comments guys, that would really help me out. Let me know what you guys think of Blade Dancers also in the comments. But as always, I was the Wiggling Wolf, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.